हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव मेडिसिन इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल लर्न अबाउट ग्राम पॉजिटिव खोखाई वेन देर इज ग्राम पॉजिटिव खोखाई वी विल सी दैट देर इज कैटेलेस टेस्ट For gram positive cocci, we do catalase test. Once you do a catalase test, there are two possibilities. One, the organism can be catalase positive, or the organism can be catalase negative. If the organism is catalase positive, then it is either Staphylococcus or Micrococcus. If the organism is catalase negative, then it is Streptococcus, Enterococcus, and Pneumococcus. Now, the main differences between Staphylococcus and Micrococcus are Staphylococcus for that you. can do oxidation fermentation test can be done if you do an oxidation fermentation test the staphylococcus are fermentative whereas micrococcus are oxidative then you can do a furosemide test in furosemide test staphylococcus are sensitive whereas micrococcus are resistant to this furosemide test then you can also do a bacitracin test for bacitracin test staphylococcus are resistant but micrococcus are sensitive for the bacitracin test then if the organism is catalase negative then it is either streptococcus enterococcus and pneumococcus so for streptococcus enterococcus and pneumococcus we should do hemolysis now in the hemolysis if it is strepto group on hemolysis if it is beta hemolysis then it can be streptococcus group a and group b if it is alpha hemolysis it can be pneumococcus or streptococcus viridens or if it is a non hemolytic then it is uh, enterococcus so this is the whole chart about gram positive cocci thank you and thank you for watching